World War II ended in 1945 when the Allied forces finally defeated the Nazi Party. Though the terror was put to a stop, the memories of the atrocities committed during the war live on to this day. Such memories are perhaps the most prevalent in the remaining concentration camps. Countless innocent victims, most of them Jewish, were sent to these camps and to their deaths. While the Germans did their best to hide the true nature of the camps, those transported were suspicious of their intentions. Prisoners did their best to hold on to their humanity, and this often meant ingenious acts of subterfuge. During World War II, more than a thousand people were transported to concentration camps every single day. Most of these people were Jewish. Eleven million people were killed at these camps, and more than a million of them died at the death camp known as Auschwitz. At the camps, the guards began the terrible process of stripping their prisoners of their humanity. This began by stripping them of their clothing and any valuables they might carry with them, like glasses or personal mementos. The loss of human life in Auschwitz is almost too staggering to fully comprehend. To put it into perspective, more people died at Auschwitz than the combined total loss for the United States and British forces in the entire war. While Auschwitz was only operational for four and a half years, one in six Jews who lost their lives during World War II were killed behind its gates. It was a veritable machine of evil and death beyond measure. It wasn't simply Jews who were held and killed at the camp. 150,000 Poles, 23,000 Romani, and 15,000 Soviet prisoners were also victims of the camp and the Nazi Party's infamously cruel plan to destroy mankind as they knew it. Behind the walls of Auschwitz, survival was the order of the day. For the men and women struggling to survive inside of its walls, holding on to personal effects was almost impossible. Still, some people went to extraordinary lengths to protect their treasures. See, when museum officials were preparing some of the objects looted by the Nazis from prisoners entering the camp, they made an amazing discovery inside a 70-year-old mug that had long been overlooked. Hidden inside the base of this mug was an extraordinary secret that was so well kept it was only discovered just now. The mug had a false base, and underneath that base were hidden valuables, a ring and a necklace to be exact. Despite the passage of more than 70 years since the liberation of the German Nazi concentration and extermination camp, there are still cases of accidental discovery of objects hidden by the victims," said a press release that discussed the find. The Germans incessantly lied to the Jews deported for extermination. They promised them resettlement work and life in a different location, and they didn't allow the victims to take much luggage with them. In this way, the Germans were confident that in the luggage, including clothes and items needed for life, they would find the last valuables of the deported families. While the fate of the owner of this mug and its hidden treasures are unknown, there's something triumphant about the fact that they hid their belongings so well that the Nazis never found them. Thank you.